Well, the hot days have arrived, and so has the sweat, streaked, shiny, non-lasting makeup. I hate it when this happens. It doesn't have to be that way, though. Alex Mulhuizen is a makeup artist with Bobbi Brown Cosmetics, and she's here to show us a few simple steps on how you can make your makeup last throughout even the hottest, stickiest summer days. So I'm so glad you're here. Well I know. Thanks for having me back. Okay, so let's first start off with face mist. So anyone that's looking to refresh or set their makeup should use a face mist. Okay. Bobby's face mist is great because it gives you an instant boost of hydration and it also helps to help your makeup stay and last down longer. Okay, and so you want to oh. it's beautiful. So you hold it out arms length okay, away. Arms length away. And spritz the face. And that's all good. Ooh. So you can use this oh, any time yes. before or after makeup, and it's your on-the-go quick pick-me-up for instant healthy glow. Okay, I love that. And then we've got blotting papers. Now, why is why are blotting papers good? So anyone that needs a blotting paper is someone who wants a way to have control or to counter that shine throughout the day, especially with the humidity. So use one paper. One use paper. one with you. And you're going to gently press. Bobby's papers are great because they are, they don't have any powders to them. Okay. But they soak up any excess shine or any oh, I see that. perspiration throughout the summer day. I know it's not That'll keep this, I know yeah, it's so gross. It oh helps. gosh. Yes. So, so but these are great because they can take the yep. shine away. All right. Then we've got morning. Out. In the mornings, you should skip eye cream, you say. Yes. Bobby's tip is to skip eye cream on the top of the lid so that your shadows don't slip or crease throughout the day. Okay. So instead, you want to use something like a cream shadow stick okay. that's like smudge this. resistant, yep, or waterproof. If that'll wear the best throughout the humidity. Okay, that'll kind of keep it so that it's not all sliding Easy around. What sliding. about primer? Is primer good there too? So you can use like a long wear eyeshadow base. That's a great way to help your makeup stay on. But if you're using something like a long wear shadow stick, you don't even have to use a primer. Very cool. Okay, then we've got use a brush, not fingers for foundation. A brush, not fingers for foundation is so important in the summer because your fingers will change the wear of the foundation. And you'll so get use sweaty. a brush. That'll help the wear last the longest life of the makeup. All right, then we've got make blush last long longer by double layering it. This I've double never heard. layering. So Bobby's great tip about blush is to start with a natural color that mimics the way your cheeks look after you exercise and then use a pop of color like a brighter tone okay. on the actual apples of the cheek. So double up and that'll make it last longer. Yep. Very cool. Two blushes. And then finally, set foundations with powder. So always set your foundation for powder when you want something that's longer wearing. Bobby says to use a brush and dust it on the areas where you tend to see shine the most. So typically the forehead, nose, cheeks and chin throughout your T-zone. And then I'll be money. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> all right, very good stuff. All these tips, of course, will be on our website. Don't, remember, don't worry, you don't have to memorize all that. But great stuff, and thank you. And you can Thanks always go see Bobby Brown Counter.